Hello and welcome to Runs Wickets Overs. I'm Sue Drinkwater and in this tutorial I'll be showing you how to download a Play Cricket fixture into Play Cricket Scorer Professional for scoring. Before we look at the download process, let's just consider what equipment is required to be able to do this. Play Cricket Scorer Professional, PCS Pro, is available to download for scorers using Microsoft Windows based computers. If you are using an iOS device, you will need a Windows emulator to run PCS Pro. The software is free of charge for scorers in the UK affiliated to a Play Cricket club. As the ECB, the England and Wales Cricket Board, pay the licence fees. Therefore, you must have a Play Cricket account and be a member of the club that you want to score for. To apply for a Play Cricket account and membership of a club site, please visit playcricket.com. When activating your Play Cricket account, search for your club and explain in the notes field that you will be scoring for this club. Your club's Play Cricket Administrator should approve your membership and give you scorer privileges to your club's Play Cricket site. When you have the correct equipment and Play Cricket membership, log in to PCS Pro using your Play Cricket username and password. To download a Play Cricket fixture, you need to be connected to the internet, but you can download a fixture when online to score later when offline. To find your fixture, click on the File menu, Start Match from Fixture option. Use the Site field to select the club that you will be scoring for. There will be a helpful yellow border around this field to indicate that is where you need to click. The drop down list in the site field will contain all the clubs that you have scorer privileges to in Play Cricket. If your club has multiple teams or plays different formats of cricket, you can use the filter buttons to reduce the number of fixtures listed. Check that the date range shown encompasses the date of your fixture. When you have found the correct fixture, click on it to select it, then click on the Continue button. Use the Start Match from Fixture dialog box to set up all match details. For Play Cricket fixtures, some data is pre-populated and not open to amend. This includes club, team names, start date, competition, match type and venue. If you have previously scored a match in which either of these teams have played, the playing squad may be pre-populated with the last players who played for these teams indicated by a yellow triangle at the top left of the playing squad. A populated list without the yellow triangle indicates that the players were pre-selected on the Play Cricket website, but should be checked before accepting them as the actual playing squad. You cannot start scoring until all fields noted with a red star have been completed. When you have set up all the match data, use the Start Scoring button to select how you want to score this match. Only one person can be the live scorer, and when both home and away scorers are using PCS Pro, the live scorer is usually the home scorer. The live scorer is the person publishing live scores and uploading the result to Play Cricket when they have an internet connection. If you are the away scorer and have an internet connection, 
then you can be the support scorer. To make sure that you are scoring the same match as the live scorer, wait until the home scorer has set the match up and started as live scorer and then use the file menu, open match option to locate the match that the home scorer has created. Select the relevant match and choose to Open as Support Scorer from the drop-down menu under the Open button. If there is no internet connection at the ground where you will be scoring, but you want to be the live scorer to be able to upload the result later, in the Start Match from Fixture Setup window, use the Save and Start Later button to download the fixture to your local database. When you get to the ground, go to the file menu and use Start Match from Fixture again. An error box will identify that you are not connected to the internet and will offer you the chance to show local data only. Select this option and the match that you created when you were online should be visible for selection. Select your local match and click on the Continue button. A message will remind you that this is a local match and ask if you want to download the fixture again or use the local match that you created earlier. Choose Continue with Local and then complete the setup details as normal. When ready, start scoring as Local Scorer from buttons in the lower right hand corner. If you have been scoring the match offline, once you are connected to the internet again with PCS Pro and the match open, click the circular arrows in the scoring sync status at the right end of the PCS Pro status bar. In the upload match box, select register as live scorer. The match should sync automatically and the scoring sync status should show up to date. Click the sync arrows again if the sync doesn't happen automatically. Be careful if one scorer is using PCS Pro on a laptop and the other scorer is using the PCS app on a smartphone or tablet and both scorers have an internet connection. Both scoring packages will update the Play Cricket website. It is advisable in this circumstance for the scorer using the PCS app to disable their internet connection. 